Shipping Exempt Human and Animal Specimen In this video, we'll review packaging, labeling, marking, and documentation requirements for shipping exempt biological substances. Exempt materials are defined as those collected directly from humans or animals, including, but not limited to, excreta, secreta, blood and its components, tissues and tissue fluid swabs, and body parts being transported for purposes such as research, diagnosis, investigational activities, disease treatment, and prevention. For example, routine testing for a medical examination, cholesterol, blood glucose, and DNA tests. Remember, if you can't make a professional judgment on the presence of pathogens, don't use the exempt classification. Now, let's review the packaging instructions. Here are the four elements you need for your packaging. Leak proof primary receptacle. This contains your sample, ensure it has a leak proof seal, tape, or parafilm screw cap. Leak proof secondary packaging. Cushioning and absorbent material. Rigid outer packaging. Before sealing the outer packaging, you must make an itemized list of the contents of the package and enclose the list between the secondary packaging and outer packaging. If you are shipping blood samples, it's important to note. A biohazard symbol is required on any sample that contains human blood and other potentially infectious materials. The outer shipping container must be labeled exempt human specimen or exempt animal specimen. For documentation, all shipments must include Bill of lading or airway bill, if ground or air transport, and five copies of a commercial invoice for international shipments. This process can be complex, so Mercury simplifies logistics for life sciences companies. And you can focus on your life-changing research while we handle the logistics. To learn more visit